Welcome to Be Great Today, weekly inspiration to start your week. I am Jonathan Bloom, or Frasley Sparksman, in the world of Warcraft. And you're in love, are we looking at the title being like, World of Warcraft Classic is an example of love? Yes. It's an example, in my opinion, of agape love. So Psychology Today has a breakdown of the seven types of love in Greek language, and I've got a link to them in the show notes at inspirationalpodcast.com slash 106. So World of Warcraft Classic just came out. You may be wondering what that is. It's a new version of World of Warcraft that goes back to the old version of the game. I know it's confusing if you don't play World of Warcraft, but there's something that's incredible though, has I've been playing this new version of the old game. People have been showing agape love to me. Okay, so there are times where you're going for a quest objective and you can only do 1% of the time going after this quest. People are lining up in a game that sometimes is about, oh, who can be first? Who can be best? Who can one-up your fellow man? And with this, people are like, hey, we're going to work together. We're going to be nice. I was walking to a city. Someone handed me some armor that I, they had no reason to give it to me because you, you could have sold that to a vendor, could have sold it on the auction house to other players, but they gave it to me to help me. I've been helping people by giving them different items that they need to help throughout their journey. And there's also a thing where people are helping other people with no return. So when you're fighting a monster in this game, there are times where in classic, you don't get any experience if somebody else is already attacking it. And you know what people will do? They will go up and they'll help you kill that mob. They'll help you kill that monster. Mob is a term in games for a, a character or a thing that you're trying to take out for an objective. So sometimes the game lingo comes through. But yeah, there are things that in this game are showing me agape love. Sometimes we do things that will not gain us any benefit. We won't get any experience for our character for helping that one person. We may not even get any treasure or loot for helping somebody. I practice philia love quite often because if I like somebody as a friend, I might do something for them. But one thing I want to try doing more is agape love, a love where there's no return. You're doing it just to be nice to somebody. You know, like when you let somebody ahead of you in line because you might get there first, you have somewhere to go, but you help somebody and you will never see that person ever again. That's agape love. And it's interesting. It is showing me through World of Warcraft Classic that people are able to show agape love. I should be showing agape love more. So that's why this week, to me, World of Warcraft Classic is showing me that there is a need in our world for agape love. And we can show that love. So it is one of the most difficult things. Let's think this week, where can I help somebody with no benefit? I may not even know that person. Probably in many cases with a copy of love, you don't know them. And what can I do to make that person's day better? I hope that I'm showing you a copy of love every week by doing this stuff for you, because I like doing these things. I hope that doing this podcast every week gives you some help, some encouragement. When I hear from somebody that it helped them, that is a, an amazing reward, but it's not going to help me in some way other than making your life better. I hope that means that I, I appreciate that it helps you, but there's no return for me physically, tangibly, other than the fact that you received something of, of mine and it made your day better. And I may never, ever meet you. So thank you for listening to this week's Be Great Today. And you can find the show at inspirationalpodcast.com. So until next week, be awesome. And I would definitely check out that Psychology Today article because there's a lot of really cool things about love. We think of love sometimes just that romantic love. It's amazing how varied the Greek artists were on love and what love truly meant. This show is brought to you by Dragon Powered Studio. Find more at dragonpoweredstudio.com.